Recently, our version 2.14 update included a new feature called Pop-Up Speech. This video is to share a little more information that supports this feature. So what is it? Pop-Up Speech is a technology adaptation now available on Sotillo devices. Pop-Up Speech is a form of dynamic text that has been shown to support the development of literacy skills in AAC users. This is an emerging research topic in the field of literacy and AAC, attempting to bridge the gap between teaching literacy skills with those using high-tech AAC systems. What does it look like? Immediately following the activation of a button on a device, the text is enlarged and uses motion to draw attention to the word. Specifically, the graphic symbol with a static text label zooms out from the symbol. The text can enlarge or fill a screen for three seconds or a different time setting, and the word is spoken. Then the text fades back yeah. into the graphic symbol, promoting the association of the text with the symbol that was chosen. I. Currently, the research focuses on static displays, no navigation, showing a oh. huge potential for learning sight words using the transition to literacy or pop-up speech feature. Check out the articles and videos at RERC on AAC. You will see dynamic text used with sight words in a grid. There are additional articles at the end of this video. TV. You can find more information about the settings for pop-up speech in the manual. Why should we use it? Pop-up speech is a new feature available in our software that has been shown to support the transition from use of graphic symbols to the use of text for communication. The dynamic text technology has been utilized in several studies with various populations. Children with language delays and disorders, children with ASD, and adults with intellectual and developmental disabilities. The results of these initial studies indicate that the use of dynamic text may positively impact basic literacy skills of individuals with complex communication needs. Although still quite new, pop-up speech may be used to support literacy instruction and infuse components of literacy learning into daily interactions. It was designed to complement literacy instruction, not to replace it. Since the research did not use the dynamic pages found in our vocabulary systems, the consultants have been collaborating and recording examples and ideas. A co-worker shared with me that a group is going to try using the feature during structured literacy instruction. They are creating profiles to enable setting changes they will use. One profile set for communication, the other profile will enable pop-up speech and the appropriate settings. Another thought was use on specific pages might work. Pages such as those found in the early books of Word Power 42 and 60 Basic. Or maybe the manual communication board found in Word Power 60 Basic. How will you use it? To learn more about pop up speech and transition to literacy, visit these articles for more information.